This is the most popular and best gun in Modern Warfare 3, and I just made it better. Plus, I dropped one of my best gameplays, then back-to-back -back nukes on the Christmas maps. Oh my days, you guys are gonna love this build. I know you guys see a lot of Wasp Swarm videos, but this one, I guarantee you, is gonna be your go-to setup. I've never used a build in this game that is more broken than this build. So, if we look at the damage range, it only has a effective damage range of 4.6 meters, which really isn't that good. This is one of the worst damage ranges in the entire game. So, usually, we would add the Ruthless or the Reckless to increase that damage range by like 30% making this thing a lot better although I do recommend you guys to try out the short compensated barrel because this one's gonna eliminate all the recoil yes it is gonna take a few extra shots at range but since the RPM is over a thousand and now there's gonna be no recoil it's gonna be very easy to hit all your shots and you're gonna be absolutely deleting everybody we all know the master cameras look amazing in modern warfare 3 but they take hundreds of hours to get so if you want to save yourself some time I would definitely check out guapsi Wopsy is a very reliable company who will play in your account and unlock anything you want with a very fast delivery time. They have been sponsoring me for a long time and I haven't seen a single negative review and so I would really check them out. I'll have their link in the description. For the underbro, we are going to be adding the best underbro for recoil control and you guys are already in no. And you know, there's just way too many underbrows in this game. Look how many there is. Oh my days. So if you're looking for the best underbro for recoil control, we all know add the Kamir Ryan 03 vertical grip. This one is going to help well with the horse on a little bit and it's going to help out the vertical a ton basically eliminating all the vertical off the weapon yes we are losing a little bit of our mobility but this gun already has insane mobility to where you're really not going to notice that whatsoever and when we go into the firing range you guys can see ads speed is still very quick and then the recoil control you can pretty much use it up to long range. It still is a little bit iffy, but overall, it is a lot easier to use. Next up, we're going to be going ahead and adding a magazine, which is kind of a personal preference thing, but it's also like not a personal preference thing. All the really good players on this game will be running a magazine since the fire rate is so fast on this weapon. You are going to be blowing through enemies. Pause. And so you're going to need a lot of ammo. And that's why I do recommend you guys to add the 50 round mag at least maybe the 40. But like the difference between these two really aren't that much. And so might as well just run the 50 in the game plays, though. I am adding the 100 round mag and the 100 is so broken because you still have a lot of mobility. But now you have 100 rounds. It's basically like an actual life machine gun. And so now from here, since that is bringing down the mobility, we are going to be increasing that. I know you guys are thinking maybe I'm going to be adding the factory or like the no stock. No stock is a very good option but the gun will bounce around a lot still is controllable like maybe if i'm on ship and i'll run the no stock but on every other map in the game if i'm running this build then i will be adding the fss rampage 4 v11 tactical i don't know what that stands for but now we are going to have an increase of our ads we by two I mean, by seven percent yes we are losing some mobility it seems a little bit weird but that seven percent increase really really does help out the weapon and the rest of the stats are already pretty good on the weapon so now you guys can see still have a pretty good ads speed despite having a 100 round mag and then when we go to shoot the gun, pretty easy to use the gun. There really isn't that much recoil. You can use it up to long range. That's what I'm saying, how this thing is so broken. You can't add a muzzle. And so if you guys do want to add a suppressor, I'll give you a variation of the build, like an entirely different build. Right now, this is like my favorite build in the game. So from here, if you want to increase that damage range, you guys can go over to the ammo at the high grain rounds. It's going to increase by 15%. Although I don't really think you need it and it's going to hurt the recoil control. And so I would kind of stay away from it, but it does kind of work out. Hollow point is very good because it's going to slow down the enemies in Warzone. Armor piercing is pretty good for shipping so you can shoot through the crates. Over pressure, this is if you want to be a complete asshole when you shoot the enemies it's going to make their screen shake a ton making it very easy for them to connect their shots although you are going to be deleting the enemies to where they don't even have a chance to shoot so it doesn't really matter too much and so for me that's why i'm not going to be adding a ammo but the ammos are still good if you want to add an optic i'm not adding a optic but i know a lot of people with this build like to add an optic you can add the slate reflector cronin is good it builds in a laser to your gun but i only really use that on the ar so for the smg for the SMGs, typically I'll add the Slate, the NIDAR Model 2023, or the MK3 Reflector. The MK3 Reflector is probably my favorite one for this build. I don't think you really need to add it, and I just have better accuracy when I don't add it, but you know, you might really like that. So here is a screenshot of a very good class. If you guys want to increase that sprint to fire speed, I would add the Solar Flare. Increase that by 12%, making this thing fire after sprinting very quick. If you want to add the best laser, I would add the VOK. Adds a little bit of ADS speed, making the weapon a lot snappier. Although, in the gameplay, I 
am going to be adding a rear grip just for a little bit more recoil control. You don't really need it, but when you do add the Marauder, it really does make the weapon very stable. We have so much recoil control and we have a lot of stability. So now our gun is not going to sway in the middle of a gunfight. Now, just to show you guys, this thing is now an absolute beam. You can use it up to long range with some practice. I missed some shots, but you guys could still see I was beaming like crazy. For the second I'm actually running a brand new Renetti build. So if you guys want the screenshot, the reason I'm running the hole puncher is so if I get close to the enemy, I can one hit them instead of two hitting them. And that actually does come in clutch a lot. This gun does have a lot of visual recoil. So when you add the slate, it does remove that a lot. If I'm on shipping, I'll run the 50. Any other map, I got the 24 brewing so we can fire our gun a little bit quicker. And then we got the rear grip, uh, this one, just so we can pull bust it out a little bit quicker then for the vest we're running the infantry vest i know i'm pretty boring we're running the infantry vest but i do like that because we can tax for a little bit longer to recharge is quicker you guys could run the gunner which gives you more ammo and then go ahead and run uh add the running boots then it's going to give you what the infantry vest does the demolition one's pretty nice too because it gives you two semitexes assassin's vest is going to keep you off the radar the enemies can call on a uav or you can uh, kill the enemy and there's not going to be like a skull above their head and you're not going to be on the radar if the enemy has a uav sorry i explained that pretty badly but if you guys just read that you guys will understand so for the shipping gameplay which is the second gameplay i'm running the trophy system for any other map in the game i will be running the munitions box so i don't run out of ammo or i will be running the ddos or the portable radar usually the munitions box though then stim semitex got these scavenger gloves because i was running the trophy system and then um on the other maps though i was running the assault gloves so then i can jump ads a little bit quicker marksman gloves are good for the ars these other gloves are pretty good but usually i stick between these three and then we got the tactical pads for the shipping if i'm not on shipping i'll run the covert sneaker so then the enemies don't hear my footsteps then lastly we got eod i know some people like to run some other stuff i just always die by nades so i have to run the eod now let's get into the quadruple actually you know i think it's five mgbs let's get into it yo dude this thing has no recoil like i made other builds and i thought they had no recoil no this is no recoil there's a little bit like less damage range but since this thing already has no damage range it actually doesn't really like impact you that badly and you just like take advantage of that mobility increase and you can just finesse the enemies over and over oh my god bro what a start yo leave a like for that subscribe with the noties on we're about to hit 100k let's go boys oh my days Wow, I still got the oil in my hands. I still got the, the lotion on. I haven't fully cleaned up yet. And we just did that. Huh? That was so close. I want to challenge. I can't challenge this. But I'm going to challenge it. But then I'm going to miss everything. Bro, I need a warm up. Why is everything so hectic and so crazy? This is amazing. I'm so happy. This is the best class I've ever used in my life. Okay, we're going to do swarm we're gonna cut in so then they don't see us i'm gonna cut up the here no i'm gonna f up that i'm gonna get behind them oh yeah this is it this the one guys this is the best smg class in the game nothing's better okay we're gonna do emp pop what's up buddy what's up man well there's no recoil Oh my god, dude! Bro, thank god it's not November. November, because I'm busting everywhere right now. Hey, yo, what the f***? Yo, is dude playing darts? Yo, respect to him, man. He's just, you know, happy new year, man. Let's freaking go. Okay, I want to push the objective, but I know they're all up there, and it's actually very difficult to push this right now. Did they leave the game? Yo, did everyone time out? What is this? No! Oh, s***. Here we go again. God damn it, dude. I fucked that up so badly. That could have been so cool. And I just sold. Okay. So, insane game. But it slowed down and turned into a mediocre game. So, I'm going to do another game after this. We're going to get an even better nuke. And my vocals will be a little bit more warmed up. And my, my skills will be more warmed up. Luckily, we're using the best class to where I don't even need to be warmed up. This cocksucker. Bro, he's mad. He's so mad. Bro, where are these guys at? Okay, so they got some new teammates. That's good. That should speed things up. Should make things a little bit more enjoyable to watch. Bro, I want to push in there. It's just we're like three off the nuke. And I know the second you push something, just randomly there's a guy in the corner. Yo, MG mother freaking B. Let's go, boys. Yo, leave a like for that. Subscribe if you haven't already. For the nasty, nasty MGBs. Now we're going to go crazy. I feel a little bit more warmed up. 
I feel more relaxed. This is actually my first game out. I'm not even lying. Yo, if you haven't seen my most recent Bass Speed video, please watch that video. That video is absolutely crazy. It has a very good SMG Bass Speed build that is now like my favorite class in the entire game. I really like like this thing though. This thing is nasty. It's just uh, the Bass B, you know. We all we all know about the Bass B. Yo, what are you doing? Yo, the hunter round mag. Hunter round mag. You think it's OD, but no, it's perfect. <laughs> it is so good. 40 round mag goes crazy. Ah, you dead. Oh, you dead. Oh, you. Whoa, 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 buddy. With shotgun, you dead. Another one. Through the wall. Nope. Guys, I'm literally getting every single. Oh, shit. Any more? Hey, my dude. Okay, they're all below us. I know I just seen someone behind me. I'm trying to make him think that there's no one else. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna do EMP. Yeah, I really hope my teammates start to do like worse or just the enemies take their head out of their ass so then I can have the game last a little bit longer. Gotta show these Christmas noobs who's dominant. Gotta show them what's up. They all probably think I'm hacking, but it's just because they're ass. I'm better. So much better than these guys. Yo, we're about to get a double nuke. This might be the nicest lobby I've ever had in my life. I think I see an X Pro MVZ. Is that a first ice ears? Okay, we're on the 20. About to get that double nuke. Someone else timed out as well. Are they just getting like so shooken up right now that they just keep timing out? What is this? Bro, my movement's messing up. Guys, first game on. I'm not even warmed up whatsoever. What? No, I got wall banged. The fuck? I thought I could like, you know, spit some shots off and then we're good. What the hell? That was EOM. MGB, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, my days. No. Ah. Uh, bro, that was so close. Imagine all that to not have any MGBs. That's crazy. Okay. I'm going to say that we dropped three MGBs. We dropped two. But we basically dropped three because that was some insanely bad net code. Even, I'm not going to change the new counter for three, though. Okay. Okay. I'm going to keep the new counter at 129. But in the intro, I don't care. I'm saying three MGBs. So I wasn't going to do ship moss shipments, but this is the last day that it's available, I believe. I actually think when you guys are seeing this video, it's not here anymore. And we have some new reskin maps, and they actually look insane. So I can't wait to make some videos on there. And I just want to do one final game of the ship moss and see how crazy of an MGB that we can get. I don't know if it's going to be crazier than the other one, but this one hopefully, hopefully will be up to par with that skid row game. You are dead. This, this gun is actually perfect for this map. We have 100 rounds. So much mobility. No recoil. You can use at any range. All around, we got a W class. And Nicki Minaj over there. Nicki Minaj is dead. Wait, no. Oh, yeah, she's dead. Rest in peace. I need to get these guys into a spawn trap. That's the way that I will get a crazy game. That's all it is, boys. You just got to figure out where they're spawning. And then, and then just hit your shots from there. Know where they're spawning. Hit your shots. Because if you know where they're spawning, you can just like, you know, aim there. You're going there. You're already facing there. You can predict where to put that, that white dot. You know exactly that they are going to be there. And if you don't know they're going to be there, we'll figure it out. Here, well, one guy left the game. He's like, I ain't playing against this, this sea bass guy, this fish guy. Oh, hell no, dude. I am not playing against him. I already know the next guy that's joined is going to be like a pro player, though. Okay, right here. I don't like... Oh, I don't like this spawn. Give me out, give me out, give me out. That's what she said. It seems like they're really slowing down, but I think it's just because like half their team backed out. We're one of 16, we got this. Yo, snoozy, what? Is that a child? Oh yeah, that's how we do it. That's how we do it, boys. That's not how we do it, though. Dude, I'm missing. Move! Dude, I hate when my teammates are just sitting in random areas and I'm trying to get through and I just can't get through. Or if I spawn in behind them all. Hey, 
MGP. Oh, that was perfect timing too. Let's go, boys. Let's freaking go. Easy nooks and nooks. Let's go, let's go, boys. Oh my days. Yes. Let's go. Okay. So there was one game I was doing before this. I almost had a crazy MGP. And then I died and then I rage quitted. I might show. I might show it in here. It was like, it was going to be my fastest MGP ever. It was like, going to be like 50 seconds long, 40 seconds. And then a, a, like a guy just spun in my cheeks. I was the Nicki Minaj operator, so it kind of made sense. But it was still so annoying. Yo, I'm going to make a YouTube short out of this. Oh my god, people are going to get mad. On the YouTube shorts. If you go into any of my shorts, people are just pissed off. It's so funny. And then I'm going to be posting ranked games and people are going to just still be mad. No! No, I did not call in the fucking MGB. No. Well, that's such a buzzkill. I think I got to do another game for you guys, maybe. I think I got to do another game. Bro, that's so sad. What? I did not call that in. Oh, I wish it was like another tab so you wouldn't accidentally call it in. But I don't think they care enough to do that. Yo, imagine what these kids are going to say if I get this MGB. No, they're probably going to say I'm hacking because that's like the new meta, the new, uh, the new thing. Everyone just says everyone's hacking. Or they're going to say bot lobby, even though they are in the lobby. They're gonna say some stupid things. Cause you said that's why you can't, huh? Woo! Okay, big pimp, I'm have to mute you, dude. Your mic is crazy right now. Camping? Big pimp was so loud, I have to mute him. So far, we're actually frying right now. We are absolutely frying these guys. Jesus! We got buoy traps? Teammate, shoot him. What are you doing? Teammate, are you against me? What is this? Teammate, you asshole. You're just gonna let me die like that. That's crazy. Contact. There's so many guys around me. Oh, it's so meant to be, man. That's so meant to be. Last bullet. Holy. These guys are, like, not that good. Like, I'm better than them, but then they're also, like, decent. It's weird. Like, right there. Like, yes, that, that guy is the type to kill me. But the man with the shotgun behind the wall. See what I mean? It's, like, little things like that. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We do have an advance. I'm going to wait a little bit before I call in the advance. I feel like I can get some easy kills. You know what? Okay, there's actually so many dudes around me. Got to call this in. We get the two. Let's go. We have to get a Christmas nuke. We need a Christmas nuke. We got a nuke on uh, on shipping. Now we have to do one on, on the hangover. We must do it. This is so satisfying. Unbelievably satisfying. Again. 
Okay, enemies. You guys actually gotta start capturing the hard point, though. I feel like they're just grouping up and just grouping together so then they don't die as much. No, buddy. You're still here? Oh, you're so predictable. You're too predictable, my man. We can't EMP them because they're already EMP'd. So that means right when this EMP is over, I'm going to call on another EMP. I feel so bad, but like not at all. Because these guys don't go play the objective. And people say, I'm not playing the objective. But well, that means you just don't know how to play Call of Duty. Because I'm going for the kills because my team is already in the objective. You only need one guy in the hard point. Twenty. Okay. Okay. Guys, we are so close. We are actually so close to this. We're gonna EMP them again. I think they're over here. Okay. They have to be over here. There's no way. Unless they're on the other side. Oh, no, are they over here? Oh, I think they are way over here. Damn it. Okay, I really sold on that. But let's let them capture the hard point. No, stay in the hard point. There you go. That's what you're supposed to do. You can win this. Enemies, you can win this. I gotta play hyper aggressive. Did he even leave the game? I don't know where they're at. No, dude. Teammates, get out of here. Why you guys have to be so good? I got the MGB, but I couldn't call it in to get the reaction. Dang it. Oh, we got the MGB. The last goal.